Out of any mule deer hunter I know, you have the best hair. <laughs> well, thanks. You gotta, <laughs> gotta bring something to the table. <laughs> God, shooter. That's a shooter. Okay. Got him. Kill him. Just like that. Nine, ten days of pushing hills hard within a matter of a minute. A uh, buck of a lifetime on the ground. What are we doing? We're getting ready to go kill a big mule deer buck. That's what we're about to go do. That's all we need to know, actually. Yep. Yeah. Got a little cold last night and got some weather, which is good. Before you were able to get down there, I went over early, remember, and uh, spent I think it was four or five days just in that country, putting boots on the ground and, and glassing and doing a lot of glassing. You know, it's big, deep, dark canyons, but it's not like in you know country we come from with the timber. We're road hunting amateurs. We we don't have a proper ice scraper. It's all right though. Make it do. For ice. That's actually working good. All right, we're just gonna go up canyon. We finally got some snow. And uh, glass and cover country. That's all we can do. We know there's deer around. It's just a matter of finding the right one. Ready, buddy? Yep. Bar for race. <laughs> What's the plan? The plan is we got to beat on some deer. And to get to them, we got to go up and over this mountain. But about 1 30, we got a bunch of time. And the deer are still up feeding this front that moved in. So I think we got a good shot. We got a good feeling about this one. tactics were just to cover as much ground and try and find the deer um, and then getting a little later in the season closer to the rut find them does and, and hopefully get a big buck coming.
some nice ones. Three by fours, four by fours. Pretty big two by three. And a lot of dough, so it's pretty cold. It's getting colder, about five o'clock. Let's see what we can find. We're just gonna stay posted up. Let's see if anything else materializes. There's gotta be something bigger in here. There's gotta be. through bucks so numbers were good that was that was great and awesome to see but you know you're seeing so many 130 inch 140 inch mule deer bucks which don't get me wrong is a great buck uh, just not what we were looking for she wrote for today. Lots of bucks, just nothing good. <laughs> I called Lance like, oh man, I feel terrible. In the brush? It was so Bad nasty rock. down there, Rocky. But I didn't mess anything up. There's one little rivet missing on a thing, but Lance said, oh, it's Tool. <laughs> <laughs> the legend himself, Rocky Jacobson, you know, he's founder of Rocky Mountain Hunting Calls. Um, you know, Bugling Bull at the time when I met him a long, long time ago, uh, he was fortunate enough to draw uh, a pretty good tag in Idaho as well. He uh, just wanted to come along. Dan, are you serious? He let me take this $150,000 worth of rig of these and look, we go through the brush. You can't get through that creek, okay? I'm telling you. <laughs> right. Let's not do that. <laughs> Nice deer, but not the one, not the one. There is bigger. And we're seeing a lot of deer, so still pretty confident we can do better, but beautiful deer. You want to have A, B, and C. At this point, I think we probably were at C, and uh, meeting of the minds and suggested that, hey, let's, let's go down and hit the, the whole country and see if we can catch a big buck transitioning. All right, we spent a bunch of time back up here in the high country. Time to shift focus and get down the mountain and, and make some more plans. I've seen a lot of deer and uh, a lot of nice bucks, but just not quite what we're looking for. I'm gonna head down and, and see what we can find. up here and this high stuff so oh
got him. All right, boys. It came down like sea buck, big buck. Put a good shot. It's over, and it's a matter of really seconds. All right. <laughs> you never know. What you, the heck? You never. You know. can go from. That's nothing. 170. Yeah, for sure. We're walking down. Rocky just throws up his arm. He's like, look at that one. <laughs> Big old buck just standing there out yeah. of nowhere. We just walked up the straw this morning. I don't even know where he came from. All yeah. we know is it's the rut and they're moving. That's what matters. You just never know what's going to happen. Holy smokes. We earned that one, fellas. Yeah. We've got a lot of miles and a lot of days. And that's Dude. That's, wild. that's a good how buck. It works, how it works out like that. Yeah. We've glassed up a lot of deer and went over a lot of bucks. So to find one like this. He so. had some good mass to him too. Yeah. Good long deep fork yeah. on the back. He's chocolate horn. I mean that's he may not be the whitest buck, but he's got everything else. Yeah, he's a beautiful deer. Yep. Are you calling me to say you found one too? Oh, cool. Cool, cool. Yeah, buddy. Is that Nick? <laughs> he goes, it's over, isn't it? I go, yeah. I go, why you come follow me? He goes, no, I'm watching you guys. No way! Yeah. Where's he at? He must, he's gotta be over up there. Yeah. He heard the shots. <laughs> and the car. Right on, man. Front, Look at that thing's a beast! Look at his body! <laughs> Holy dude. smokes, dude! Dude, he's all smelling right it up too. I mean he's dude! He's a little devil. Look at that. What Check the heck? Look at his eye guards. <laughs> Holy <laughs> crap! Yeah. Dude! That's a dream to make. It's not very really often you get ground growage. Yeah. yeah. Are you kidding me? Give me some. That is <laughs> That's ground growage. Yeah, right thank there. you guys so much. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Absolutely. yeah. Sorry, honey, you got more taxidermy bills. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the chest on him, man. Look at that. That's a hoss. He's a Thank pig. you, meal deer. That is a hoss. We're surrounded around good people, and we kept positive. You know, we know what it takes, and we earned this one. Ooh, for sure. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We earned this one. This side is so impressive. <laughs> that is impressive. That is impressive. We worked hard. Yeah. That's, that's, I love it. Coming from what country we come from, you know, and how we grew up hunting. This is the only way we know was to pound the hills and put in the time, and that's why we appreciate it and love it. And we're so blessed to be able to come out here and do it, you know. Yeah. Great stuff. Hey, and, and that buck, I mean, we decided to kill a buck like that from the beginning. I mean, when yes, we started. Absolutely. So absolutely. I don't think we nope. didn't make a mistake. I have enough experience in the hunting world to know that a deer like that, you don't walk, especially after the time that we put that in, we, yeah. you know.